We got a new level. Yep. The Forest Naval. So this is where you get the blue guys? This is where I get the blue guys. Cool. It is inside of a cave. Or at least I think so. It's just really dark. So you don't know. Yeah. Probably a cave, though. Yeah, I think it's a cave. That's or a weird. forest. Yeah, it might actually just be a forest canopy. <laughs> <laughs> but it, but it's just so dark in the outsides. I'll be the judge of it. All right, so I'm gonna get the blue guys. This is how you do it. I got him. Yeah, it's really that easy. Wow. In Pikmin One, you literally just walk in the new area and you get the new guys. In Pikmin Two, it's much harder to get them. I, yeah, like you have to use the skills of the other Pikmin, I'm assuming, in order yeah. to actually get the next one. Like, in Pikmin 2, the blue guys are in the um, second area of the game, like other than the tutorial level. Yeah. But you can't get them until you get the yellow guys from the third area. So you have to backtrack. Yeah. Although you have to backtrack in this one in order to do a bunch of stuff that you have already done. Yeah, but... like, like, um... There's still two play. There's still two treasures in the sec the level we were at before. We need to get, and then in the first level there's one more treasure. Oh, that's not too hard to get though. We just need um, a decent amount of Pikmin to get it. But that's the that's the thing I don't like. That um first tutorial level has a piece that we need to um, waste an entire day to get. But, yeah. But it's not too bad because um that first level has a lot of resources really nearby, so we can get a big amount of Pikmin on that day instead of just wasting it all. Unless if you go and try to fight one of those big things again and then get totally screwed over. <laughs> well, no, none of those are in that. None of those are in the first level. There's only one. At, there's actually only like one real enemy in the first level. Wasn't the one... Uh, so the last level you were just in, is that the second level? or? Yeah, we were in the tutorial level on the first day. Oh. So it's a really small area. Oh, okay. Then there, like, yeah... The First level is just really small. There aren't any actual enemies on the first day, but later on there are a couple boss enemies that are actually they're really unique monsters, but pretty easy. They can't actually kill any of your Pikmin. They just um, troll you kind of. Okay. But there are these um, clams that open up, show a treasure, and after a few seconds snap shut. So you can lose a lot to those guys. <laughs> so you, that sounds like Mario 64 shit. <laughs> yeah. So you have to like throw guys in, have them break open the treasure get like a few hits in and then call them back before it snaps shut and you lose all your guys. Oh man. Because if you're too if you're too zealous you can lose like 30 guys in one second for those fuckers. Yeah. It's... it can be embarrassing. Now this level... Honestly I don't really like it. It's way too big. Looks fine to me. Uh... Wait, is it, is it... is it in the shape of something? No, no, it's just um... Just a random design. Oh, it looks like a picture of something for a second. I don't know. Yeah, I, I, I'm not a fan of this level. I just find it too big and there's um, just a little too much shit. Uh, like, I never know... Like, the other ones have a more of a structure. This one, I never know where to go first. But this guy I have to fucking kill immediately. What, what is this guy doing? He's a bread bug. He's a bug shaped like a loaf of bread. Oh. I thought it was just because he liked bread. No. He wanders around and um he's he's like an anti Pikmin. He um takes stuff and carries it back to his nest. So um if you're carrying something, he can pick on he can pick it too and it becomes like a tug of war match. Oh. So you have to put more Pikmin on it to counteract him and drag him to drag him to your nest instead of him dragging you to his nest. So it's just better to kill him off right right away. Yeah, like it, it's um it does a lot more damage when you drag him to the nest, but um it's still possible to do this. It's just really annoying. <laughs> Fuck you. How many is there? What? How many of these guys is there? There's only one. Oh. There's a lot more in the second game, but these guys are scary. Oh Fuck. shit. I'm out. I'm out. I'm oh, gone. they killed one. Yep. Shit. And there goes the bread bug. Yeah. Well, that's the problem. There's only fucking one. Like on the first day, you get the onion. It stays in that really awkward location, and I don't like it there. I don't want it to be there. It's can dumb. You, so you can move it. No, it, it goes back to like the main area on the second day. Okay, so these guys oh, can carry that. Oh, you have the exact amount. Oh, oh no, right, they're fine. Yeah. yeah. You guys can bring that and I have to head back to base. Hopefully there's nothing on the way that can kill them. No, I think I'm good. Oh, I What's that? that? That's a little geyser. If you break it open, it can like it, you can use it as a shortcut. Oh, cool. Pretty cool. 
So I have to break this open for that their shortcut. Or else they have to take Wait, why is your ship up here? That's just where we landed. What do you mean? Huh? What are you talking about? Wait, so is that the first area? Or is that is, what? What are you talking about? I'm confu you're confusing me. Oh oh right, the ship took off and then and then landed there. I forgot about that. Yeah. I, I just kind of thought it was just in in this area for no reason. I don't know. The, the ship travels with the onions. Okay. That's strange, but okay. It's just that the ship can't go into orbit right now. It can only go into like low orbit. It just you just can't you can't breathe. Oh. Because we we don't have the cockpit the oxygen supply yet. Those are kind of important. Yep. And just a little. Hopefully these guys can break it in time. Wait. So how did you? Uh... How did I what? How, how'd you stay in the ship if there's no cockpit? You just sat down, used a seatbelt. Okay. Seatbelts save lives. Um, I won't argue with that, I guess. <laughs> Except those stupid airbags, those just kill people. Yeah, fuck those. I don't like airbags. I've never had one go off, but still. I did. I don't trust them. When I was four. Oh. Although, oh, wait, was that nice? I forgot if I was in the front seat or not, but I remember being... Um, in the car with my mother when we got into an accident one time. That's not good. Black ice. Ah. Uh, yep. That black ice is never nice. Nope. Not even that rhymes. Rice. I realize that's why I followed it up with a, another pointless rhyme. Yep. Pointless is my middle name. It's right after John. Axel Pointless Lens? Yes. That, that's... That is my preferred name. Yeah. I'm a fan of it. And I fucked up. I dropped some dudes. I dropped some more dudes, god damn it. So yeah, that I don't like this is the level that always screws up my runs. Cause I'm just not that good at it. <laughs> I never know where to go first. There's just so many places to go. So I'm just gonna have fun. They can do that. What's that? That's a stick. That's cool, I guess. It's a climbing stick. Pikmin climb on it. There's another climbing stick I have to break right now. It's over... What the fuck is it? Um, I'll just use the map. There it is. Also, I need to break... I, I forgot about that fucking bread book. I need to beat him. I need to oh beat yeah, him fuck that guy. Is he carrying something? Yeah, he has a piece. He's, he ate a ship piece. What an asshole! So I need to I need to kill him. That's Fuck that guy, I man. I need to beat him up. Yeah. Oh man, you got him. You got him. You're good. Oh, here we go. What an asshole. Yeah, he tries to take the pellets, but um, we're going to drag him back to the base. And kill him. Good. Quite viciously. Good. And now those guys will... That should be him. So yeah, let's watch. Wait, is he dying slowly right now? No, he's just being dragged. Because he wants that piece and he's too stupid to let go. Oh. Come on. Come on. Hurry up! I really need to break those things <laughs> and make the shortcuts. This is taking way too long. But I don't know where all the bomb rocks are in this level because, um, as I mentioned, I'm not an expert in this level. I don't like it. That's it's, fine. It's too open. There's not much some direction to it. How many levels is there? Um, boom. Five. So yeah, there we go. Yeah! Yeah, the space float. That guy got fucked. Cool. It's a floaty for space. Makes sense. Yeah. I know it does. It's also ridiculous, but that's why I like this game. Like, if you go to a planet that has a dense atmosphere, you can swim in it. Yeah, that helps. Yeah. I like it. Yeah. Makes sense. Yeah. I mean, not at all, but it makes yeah. sense. Ooh. Yeah. And that's, I believe that's also a required part. You, you can't fly back home without it. Or else your ship explodes. Whoa. Jeez, that's bad, and your ship fucking explodes. That sucks. It does. Considering all the bit, all the uh, effort that you put in, mm -hmm. well, that's a lot. That's the reason why a lot of people don't like this game because it makes them feel bad because they're not good at it. Am I rude? Um, no, Thank you're you. the nicest person. Thank you. That's good to know. I fucked up. Where's the gear? Oh, they they did a good job. I didn't even notice they're already bringing that gear back. Whoa, good for them. They are talented. Ah, whatever. You Wait, which have. ones? The guys I brought over here. Oh, those guys? Yeah. Where is it? Oh, it's already been taken back. It's far away now. Yeah, they, they all... Go. Oh. A couple of them died. Yeah, but yeah, that's okay. 
It's not preferred, but that's worst things have happened. Yeah, see, they got another that's piece. That's awesome. So I'm not doing too bad at this level right now. But so how many pieces are you at for this day? Two. Yeah, I, I think two more. Yeah, two pieces I got this day. How many more do you think you can get today? Yeah, let's see. Let's see if I can remember that one. Mm, I don't like that one. That one takes a lot of blue guys, so I probably can't get it. I might get that one. Fuck no. Fuck no. What about the one down there? Um, On the bottom. That's the longest one to go get. And it, it takes blue since like that shaded part is water. Oh, okay. This piece I need every type for in abundance in order to get. There's like a layered puzzle to get, get it. Oh. So uh. I'm going to see how many you need for that one and then try and get that one. Cool. Do it. I will. You won't. That was rude. Why do you always doubt me? <laughs> Not always. Just just uh, putting the pressure on. Don't feel what? Just putting the pressure on. Mm. Makes me feel bad. Makes me feel inadequate. Hey, so Freddie Mercury, Mercury was under pressure. Mm. So was David Bowie. What the fuck? What the fuck are you doing, Red Pikmin? You stupid! <laughs> Why did you just walk right into <laughs> your death? <laughs> Why did you do that? Ah, I want to save them, so they're okay. They're fine. Don't worry. What happened to that bread bug corpse I was carrying? Didn't it get absorbed? No, it didn't. I think I'm... it got stuck somewhere. Are you sure? I I don't know. It just well, it would be underneath the onion, right? Did I get it? It 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 got killed underneath the the onion thing. Because the, the Pikmin brought the, uh... Yeah, but they did. The they were, oh, no, they're there. They're coming right now. Oh. I mean, like, the bread bug corpse. Yeah. They haven't brought that yet. They're, they're, they're bringing it right now. Good for them. Took them a while, but whatever. And now these fucking red guys will latch on to it and kill themselves. Because they're just that dumb. Nope, none of them did. Well, that's because I picked them up in time. If I didn't, they would be that dumb. Because... Pikmin and Pikmin 1 are not that smart. Quite unfortunate, but they be a little dumb. <laughs> then there's this asshole who breathes fire. No! Oh, Kill so him. do you need the red ones for it? Yep, there we go. No. See, I'm learning. But I can also just kind of walk past him. Yeah. That works too. That guy's going to turn around. Oh shit, what's and that? That guy squishes you, and he is the worst. Sounds like it. Because he can kill a lot at once, and it's quite unfortunate. He's a, he's actually really terrifying. Is this another exploit, or...? No, that, that's what you're supposed to do. Oh. And the gravity jumper. Ooh! It's another piece. Oh, that's a spring. Yeah. Oh. And so I can get this, and then... There's another bridge on the other side, and then there's another piece right down here. There we go. Whoa! But this piece, I think, takes a lot of guys... And you have to kill these frogs first, or else they will wreck you. And there's a bottle right there. Cool. Yeah. By the way, in case you haven't figured out, the Pikmin planet is Earth. Yeah? Like, millions of years in the future when humanity is extinct. That's cool. A little depressing, but... Yeah, whatever. That's how life is. Olimar is really small, right? He's like... He, he is two inches tall. Okay. Or one inch. Very small. He's a wee little bugger. This is, is does the lore depict what planet he is from? Hockatate. Cool. The name of the company he works at is Hockatate Freight. <laughs> the story is he is on vacation right now, and his sh travel ship got hit by a meteor, and he misses his family. And I always wondered, why didn't he bring his family on vacation with him? What a dick. Well, to be fair, if he did, then they would probably risk death. They would, but he didn't expect to get hit by a meteor. No, but... Like that was just an unfortunate event. Maybe it was just, like, safety precautions. Maybe he, uh... Maybe all his family members had, like, a premonition that this trip is gonna go wrong and they didn't want to go on it. Maybe. Like some Final Destination shit. Oh, God. And all of them are, I was like, ah, those that's movies. fine. Yeah, they, they those were... movies are terrible. They are. They're really bad. And I lost... Fuck! Jesus, lost, like, I lost five. four guys there. Oh, and, and they I tripped! another three. Rip. Damn it! So yeah, this is, that's why these guys are the worst. Yeah, I need fucking 40 for this. And that's, wow. That's way too many. Like, I can't do that right now. Does their health stay the same if you hit them? 
Not over days, but in general, yeah. Well, it looks like this day is just about finished. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm not beating this day. Well, I'm not. Sorry, I'm not. I'm not getting any more pieces this day. But maybe this one, the spring. No, I, I won't be able to bring it back in time because there's a lot of enemies in the way. And it's 25. Well, how many are working on that log there? Yeah, I don't need them to do Seems that. Seems like right a now. lot more than 25. But yeah, there's there's two. I don't have enough right now. Will they stay there and try to get that piece though? Right now, I don't have days? Enough time. Oh. No, but if they move the piece, then it'll stay in that position. So I won't have to like roll down the bridge again if it rolls up. Oh. And the bridge can roll up after a few days. Oh. So it just makes it quicker to get the next time. Okay. Well, yeah. Well, hopefully they uh, they and, bring it over the bridge. Yeah, but I'm just gonna pray day. that um they don't walk right in the path of all of these guys. They probably will. They definitely will. Like I said... I think that they are right now. Pikmin are not smart. And I only have 10 seconds left. Hurry, gather your Pikmin. I just have to make sure that everyone is safe. Yeah, they're all right there. They're all good. And both of those are bosses. Cool. Neither of them are fun. <laughs> in fact, I'm probably going to have to look at the strategy for this guy because he is tough. That guy's easy. Don't tell anyone. Yeah, I don't know. I know. Oh, people are going to be upset. I will I will do it blind. Uh, I just think that that's one of the guys where um, if you bring in a ho Oh, they're fucked. They're fucked. Right into They're him. fucked. He missed. Wow, what a dumbass. No time. Okay, well, cool. That was the, that was the fifth day. Hey, you got it really far though. Yeah, I, I didn't do bad. I got um I got two pieces this day. So I'm, re I'm reaching my quota right now, but I need to get like three pieces in a few days. So the, the Pikmin that were at the onions, like you don't need to regather them or anything like that. No, no, they're, they're safe if they're under, they're safe if they're in the safe area. Okay. But if they're out in the field, they'll die at the end of the day. Shit. So that's not good if you have like a bunch of people working on something at once and you lose all of them immediately. Yep. It's sad. So yeah, on the next day I'm going to go back to that original place, to the tutorial level, Fight the boss, get the last piece, and the main thing I want to do there is completely increase all the population of all of my Pikmin to above 100. Alright. Since there is a lot of shit really close around there to give you a very good increase. And I only have 26 blues, I need a lot more. Yeah. I probably won't get over 100, but I'll try. It's okay, you did good. I believe in you. Next time on Serious Pixel. Yep. We're going to be serious. We're going to... About this playthrough. We're going to be serious. This is serious business. This is, this is like speed run no death. Yeah. Even though I've got like 50 deaths. Bye! See ya! Okay.